Hey you guys and girls and thank you for watching to another episode of the Xbox Tester. My name is Maurice and today we are going to try Paradise Lost on Xbox Series S. Uh, it's a brand new game, it just came out today and I was really really looking forward to this one. Um, <clears throat> I heard a lot of good things about this game. So yeah, it's a, a dystopian game that's um, in an alternative uh, reality where um, um, Hitler has won the Second World War and Europe is completely in ashes. And uh, yeah, this is a game that's about the five um, uh, uh, things of, of grief. And it's all told by a little boy. And Joop is also here. So Joop, okay. Bye you. But yeah, this is um, this is a brand new game and I was really, really looking forward to. So yeah, let's just start. First of all, let's check how much data the game is on your hard drive. And that's uh, 14 gigabytes. It's not on Game Pass, so uh, yeah, you just have to uh, buy it. It's not an expensive game, by the way. It's only 15 bucks. So yeah, I really hope it's worth it. So let's let's check it out. It's made in the Unreal 4 engine. It's not optimized for next gen. So yeah, I'm, it's probably still at 30 FPS, but I hope it has a uh, unlocked frame rate uh, mode. I have been checking the settings a little bit, but there are no um, extra graphic settings for this game. So yeah, let's just uh, start it up. New game. I haven't played a second of this game, so uh, you guys are at the same level as I am. Bunker Gesellschaft. So let's see what's going to happen with this game. So it's a narrative game, it's single player, it's... Uh also the achievements are, have the, the, the four stages of grief. <clears throat> Five stages of grief, sorry. And you guys, if you like this kind of content, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. It means a lot to me. And I really enjoy it when you guys are asking me questions. I always try to react back, but uh, I don't always have the time for it. So please bear with me. So yeah, what I have heard is that uh, this is uh, this game is um, played in a uh, uh, world where uh, Hitler has won the World War and um, it had a complete nuclear uh, uh, blast over complete Europe and uh, this is the 1980s. And I'm really curious about this game. It already looks very, very good. And yeah, this that, that the Unreal 4 engine is of course one of the best engine that runs at Xbox. I think this one and the the, the ID Doom engine or Quake engine, what's it named? Are some of the best running engines on the platform. And don't forget the um, uh, Reach for the Sky engine from uh, from Capcom. That's also an amazing engine. Those are some of my favorite engines. I'm really, really curious about the Unreal 5, the U5 engine. What game will be the first on next-gen consoles that will use the uh, U5 engine? I think it will be Senua's Sacrifice. I think that will be one of the first games that uses the, the Unreal 5 engine. At least I hope so. So we see some footsteps in the snow. Denial.
clutch and cool. I'm scared of the dark too. This is how we fight it. See? This is how we fight mm. it. And now mom is going to make it all warm and cozy and you tidy up your toys, okay? It'll be warm in no time. Nobody likes when it's cold, right? Maybe when you're big and strong, the winter will go away. What do you think? Yeah, that's what I thought. It There's feels no a little bit like um, that game, day day. Uh, Plague Tale Innocence, in style. Did I tell you how brave you are? <clears throat> well, even I if really I did, do a video on I don't say it enough. Someday. You think I'm boring? Yeah? One of the but best that's what games. Mom is all about. The last Being generation. Boring. That almost Time no sleep, one, one knows. No matter how dark the night, the new day sun will rise. Amen, Tayote. I otherwise I can't play a first person game because I am a inverted game. continuing to decline. Some of the men are getting restless. I suspect as some of them have realized that their Oberlieutenant Oberlieutenant knows little as they do. I understand that our mission is top secret when we are possibly the best equipped unit in the entire German army. Purpose still remains a mystery to us. Okay. This is probably a game that takes place in Germany, I think. Maybe Poland? Because of the names. Pretty dark. And here. There's light at the end of the tunnel. It looks pretty good. game. This is not half bad. What was that? What happened? Is everything all what right? What happened? Is everything all right? It's nothing. It didn't sound like nothing. Well, are you going <laughs> to bring me that rotor or not? It's broken. Why didn't you say so? Mom? Who's this? It's no one. Do you understand? It's no one. Would be awesome if this game could get a next gen update. It's probably too early. I need 
to do this sort of thing. First, I think I need to do something first. Uh, the first thing I'm going to do is making the graphics a little bit lighter. Oh, that's better. No, it's not better. Accept. Ah, that's better. Yes. Now I can see something. Right trigger. Definitely 30 FPS. Story driven, a little bit of a walking simulator kind. Interesting game. What's your favorite story driven walking simulator single player game? Please let me know. I'm really curious. Psavator. Endlich geborgen. Not completely German. <sighs> I think. But correct me if I'm wrong. Let's see. 
Dear Grandma, you won't believe who's on the train with me, Greta Müller. You were just playing her record to me. She's so elegant, blah, blah, blah. He even drew a picture of the Führer for me. But I think he made Göring look a little slimmer than he really is. Okay. think that I'm that I am German I'm not German but I almost live at the German border so I can read German I can understand German allowed in Gesellschaft okay can speak a little bit German. Okay. Well, I think one of the creators of this game was really proud of that cup. Curious where this game is going. Going I'm leaving. Do you hear me? And you're not going to stop me. I don't want to spend my whole life here. Mama? You're in some kind of bunker. Mama. Mama, are you okay? Mama, shoot. Not a headache, uh, 30 FPS. But that's always, if it's a single player game, it's just like with, with, the, with the medium. Um, the medium is also at 30 FPS. But it's a really slow game, so 30 FPS isn't that big of a deal with games like this. It's much more a deal with shooters and uh, uh, racing games and other stuff with games like these so yeah this is uh, a first look at paradise lost and yeah for only 15 bucks i would say yeah pick it up it's a steal and i think it's a really good game it's not on game pass so you just have to buy it and uh, yeah check it out i'm going to play this game uh, a lot more after this video so uh, yeah you guys i really want to thank you for watching to this episode of the xbox tester and um, yeah until next time bye bye thanks for watching <laughs>